everybody. It's your boy Razor Ramon the Barber. And I'm back with another fragrance review. Yeah, man, I'm back with another fragrance review. Currently, at the shooting of this video, we send at 1,562 subscribers on the road to 2,000. So I need y'all to do your boy a favor, man. Yeah, I need you to do your boy a favor, man. Ain't that right, baby? <laughs> I need you to like. I need you to share. I need you to comment. And what we need them to do? And I need you to subscribe. Yeah, man. I need you to do that for your boy. So we get to 2,000. We're going to worry about 3,000. All right, man. I just unboxed this. Uh, this amazing fragrance. Uh, Bond Perfumer by uh, Fold 2. Or should I say Fold 2 by Bond Perfumer. Uh, you want to check out the uh, unboxing. I did it over uh, uh, the link. Uh, it's over in my IG. I got the paper and paper right here. But yeah, but anyway, y'all know how we do on the channel, man. Uh, gonna get straight to the point. You know, I got the uh, the beer bombs and the beer oils. I ain't even got none of that in front of me right now because it's just completely a fresh unboxing. Uh, first impression. Uh, you can check the uh, the link in the description for the beer oils and beer bombs and the um, five dollars off each jar for uh, JB's Butters, man. Um, we sipping on a look. I do got that Cardi, though. I do got that Cardi. Yeah, man. Sipping on a little rum. Little rum. Cheers, Chico. All right, we're gonna get into this first impression unboxing. As you can see, what the box look like it's a 30 ml bond perfumer bond <laughs> 30 ml this slip off got some writing on the bottom we got the logo we got the logo in the middle like that pop open it's sitting there like so. As you can see, I ripped it a little bit trying to get it out. Oh, God. All right. Let's come out again. This is a 30 ml. This is a, a EDP, if I'm not mistaken. Let me see. Yep, EDP. Go to the bottom. Vanilla Caramel and Santal. Santal is a fancy uh, French way to say sandalwood. This thing got a fire hazard on it. Nice animizer. <sighs> Man. All right, so when you look at the accords on this, if you're new to fragrances, accords are adjectives that are describing the notes that you are smelling. The accords are vanilla. You got some sweet, some caramel, powdery, some floral, woody, um, balsamic and warm spicy um i already sprayed it on my skin in the other uh unboxing on ig but we'll spray it on that just again to relive it two sprays this thing fill up a room man so this is a dry down right here i can definitely pick up on the sugariness the sweetness it's like a light sugar on it, almost like the the sugar that you sprinkle on top of a sugar cookie that's the that's what i get from a sugar cookie you know those uh those sugar cookie in Walmart, uh, they got the white icing on it or the pink icing on it. Uh, the junk they sit up front right when you first walk in that sell out real quick. That's what this reminds me of. Those um, almost like the pink uh, sugar cookie frosting that they sell at Crumble. That's what this reminds me of. But you definitely do get it. So on the opening, you do get this almond, nutty, uh, creaminess, but it has a sharp, sweet juice to it almost and that comes from the apple so your top notes is almond blossom so it do have some floralness to it uh a, a nice white uh bright floralness to it um with with uh with the crispness of juice of an apple it almost like you got a, a amber a amber accord to it too because it's bright 
Then you start to get into the middle notes, which is that Madagascar vanilla and some more heliotrope, some more florals. Um, and then to dry down, you get a nice, creamy, thick, rich caramel with some sweetness of a sugar. the sugar. You get some uh, a nice, smooth, uh, pleasant uh, santal or sandalwood. You get an oily benzoid, and you get some musk. So this is unisex, but I will warn uh, the fellas, if you don't like gourmands, if you don't like a sweet, floral, uh, cookie, pastry um, kind of deal, I would stay away from this because this is definitely uh, one of those... Uh, nice gourmand bombs man but hey i'm gonna be rocking this junk because i like gourmands i like cake cookie pies i like those kind of vibes especially if you're in the layering fragrances like this would be good this would go great with like some 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 uh more manly like fragrances like uh to layer this like with a vintage or something like that something that's like uh smoky leathery uh uh Pineapple things of that nature. Uh, this will go great with it, like Hachi Vot, uh, like a uh, Javante, uh, not Javante, Javante, Javante Privé Reserve, uh, like Jazz Club by the Fireplace. I'll layer this with Stronger with You, um, Camera, you know, stuff like that, man. Especially around these times where you starting to um, get into that early fall, where you starting to get into the more cozy. Um, um, interpersonal, you know, you got on your coats and the things of that nature. When that breeze picked this stuff up, man, people are gonna smell you down the street, man. But again, the dry down on this is nice. You get that nice, creamy, smooth vanilla. Again, you get some floralness from the heliotrope. Uh, then it starts to dry down, man, to that, uh, again, a nice uh, textured uh, caramel. When I think of the caramel in this, man, it's almost like those, uh, those caramel slapsticks. If you, if you ain't old enough, you, you don't remember that. <laughs> but they used to be called uh, like tall boys or long boys. You remember them candy boot? Mm -hmm. Like the caramel slapsticks. Uh, that's what the caramel kind of remind me of this, man. Like a nice, thick, rich caramel. Man, with some nice sugary uh, 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 additions to it. It's not a, just, uh, just a sugar bomb. But the sugar is in there because uh, it's mingled with the... Uh, Almost like the pastry vibe of it. It's blended real well, man. This is definitely a dope, dope fragrance. Uh, I got this for like 32 bucks off Amazon, this uh, 30 ml. And I went and checked back today. The same 30 ml, like $65 right now. So I guess a lot of, a lot of people buying it. And when uh, supplies get low, uh, you know, they jack the price up. But uh, this is my first impression. Um, easily, man, I'm giving this an 8. Um, an 8.5. Uh, off the rip, um, I got to see how it changes, you know, uh, see if it's just linear or see if it changes a lot. Um, cause I do kind of get all the notes, uh, within like the, the first 10, 15 minutes of the fragrance. Uh, but that, that don't mean it's a bad fragrance, but, uh, I just like to see how much will it change. Cause some fragrances cost three, four, five hundred dollars and they're linear, but they still smell good. Um, so that, that don't, um, deter me from wearing it. Uh, it's just a part of my, my rating scale. Um, but again, if you like Gourmands, if you like Gourmands, it's a 10. It's a 10 easily. But it just for just grading on the regular uh, curve of a, um, a grading scale, I give it like an 8.7. I give it like an 8.7. I keep going up. I really want to give it a 9. <laughs> I'm going to go and give it a 9, man. It's a 9. It's a nine. I got to see how long it lasts and how I perform, but I love it. I love it, man. But I'm also a, a gourmand head. I love, uh, I'm, I'm fat, man. You know, I like cakes. I like pies. I like pastries. Uh, you know, what 50 say, I love you like a fat kid, love cake. <laughs> hey, anything that smells like a cake or a pastry or a pie, man, good with me. But again, man, uh, this one of those ones that's going to prep you for fall that needs to be in your repertoire if you like gourmands, man, especially for fall, especially if you like layering, man. Not a long video, but it's definitely a dope fragrance, man, from the house of Bond. Parfums Bond. <laughs> 402, man. 402. Definitely, definitely, definitely dope, man. Definitely dope. Again, man, great atomizer. Oh, man, that thing like a fire hazard. That thing shoot out, boy. Man, uh, thank y'all for the support, man. We on the road to 2,000. We're going to continue to grind. We're going to continue to press. We're going to continue to drop content. Remember, 
Uh, my shine don't take away from yours, and your shine don't take away from mine, man. We're going to continue to uh, build. We're going to continue to drop content. All praise to the most high, man. Until next time, it's the transmission.